Hey everyone, everyone. welcome Welcome back back to to Five Minute Eats and we're in the midst of pizza roll week here on Five Minute Eats and today we have got the OG. This is none other than the Totino's pizza rolls. This is the pepperoni variety. You get 50 rolls in here for at Walmart. The price is $4.48 making it the most expensive of the week at nine cents or if you really wanna split hairs, 8.9 cents per pizza roll. So by far the most of the week. So this is the king, right? Totino's, man, the one we all grew up eating. And so, you know, like I said in day one, when I was growing up, I loved it. But as I got older, I started noticing there was flaws in it. Mm -hmm. So I didn't really mess with it, but I do love the, the Totino's pizza. Yeah, the party pizza. The party pizza, they're like a dollar or something like that, dollar fifty at Walmart. Mm-hmm. They're really good, man. Those for are great. For what they are, yeah. Yeah, for what they are, exactly, right? Mm-hmm. And I think overall, Totino's is a pretty good brand. I just felt like, you know, when I was eating those back in the day, these things, they needed some improvement. And so, guys, if you're new to our channel, basically, we review every day grocery items. So, before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. And taking a look at this thing, it looks... Wait, what's inside of there? Is that like uh, a cube of cheese? One cube of cheese, one cube of pepperoni, and like a tiny little spit of sauce. So this is day three. This compared to the other two from the first two days, yeah. this thing is empty. Yeah, and in this end, there's only one and a half cubes of cheese and no pepperoni, so. Let's get into it. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, welcome back to our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a thumbs down. I don't hate it, but just like I said, there's flaws in this thing. Number one being, there's just no consistency with these. They're all different. So sometimes there's a lot in there, other times there isn't. Another reason I don't like this is the crust. It's chewy. Mm. There's just too much effort dealing with the, the crust compared to the others we've tried. Whereas with this one, I don't wanna like, you know, like I said, the crust in a pizza roll is not the star. You don't wanna mess with it. And when it comes to the crust, I don't want this much hanging around, right? I want a lot of sauce, pepperoni, and cheese. You want it wall to wall? I want it to be wall to wall. This, thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. All right, for me, this one is going to be a thumbs down. I don't hate it. I could eat it again. Would I choose to eat it again and buy it again? No, that's why it's a thumbs down. I love the sauce. Hmm. Now, the pepperoni, it's got some spice to it. Hmm. What do you think? All right, <clears throat> well, I'll start with the outside and work my way in. The crust is quite chewy. It also has like kind of dry spots, like even on the inside, where you look at it and you're like, man, there's like, it's dry. Like there's no sauce even clinging to it. And the others weren't like that. so. I don't love that because then you are left with these bits where you're just like, man, I'm just eating crust with nothing else to go with it. It's kind of pointless. Now, the cheese was fine. Um, I would say that there was way, way more cheese than there was pepperoni because I cracked open, I think, three of them and all of them had significantly more cheese than pepperoni. One of them had no pepperoni and only cheese. So a little bit of quality control issues there. The pepperoni did have a nice spiciness to it, but also a couple of them were like weirdly very, very soft, like Vienna sausage texture soft, which I want my pepperoni, especially like a diced one to have a little bit more bite to it. So I didn't love that. It was a little off-putting. I did not love the sauce. Now, I fully understand it is more than likely the same sauce that they use on the party pizza, but I feel like on there, it just works better because there's a better ratio of ingredients like crust and pepperoni and cheese and all that stuff. Whereas in here, it just seemed like a lot of like black pepper, not really anything else going on. It's also quite a thin sauce, whereas the others had more body to them. And I feel like that's also where you get the issue of 
parts of the crust just not having sauce on it. It's not clinging, you know? So it just doesn't work for me. To sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.